One patient I would love to tell you about is a young woman named Annalisa. She came to me after being diagnosed with stage four breast cancer. She was just diagnosed stage four right out of the gate. She was not someone who had an earlier stage breast cancer that later progressed. At the time of diagnosis, she was already stage four. Naturally, she was caught off guard. She was fearful that she didn't want to do a strictly conventional approach to her cancer treatment. So she came to me and we reviewed her case. She had what's known as inflammatory breast cancer. So the cancer was not only inside the breast, it also was involving the skin of the breast. We knew from testing that her cancer had also spread to numerous lymph nodes in her chest as well as to her liver, and it likely had spread to her lungs as well. And we talked about the fact that her cancer was extensive. She had done some research to find out that that kind of diagnosis does not typically have a great prognosis. But she came to me and she said, Dr. Stegall, I know I want an integrative approach to my cancer. I'm determined to be one of your success stories. We start with a 12-week treatment program here in my office. And she said, Dr. Segal, after the 12 weeks, I'm going to be cancer-free. And I said, okay, let's, let's lock arms and let's do it. So we went through the, the 12 weeks of treatment. She received our, our chemotherapy, immunotherapy, various supportive therapies, various IVs. We talked a lot about nutrition and she committed to a, a really strong nutrition plan and followed through with that. She took the supplements and other medications we asked her to be on. And sure enough, after 12 weeks, we got her scan and clear, no evidence of cancer. And we got advanced testing to look for, for little, little tiny fragments of, of cancer DNA in the blood. Negative, couldn't find any. So she truly was cancer free with no evidence of disease after the 12 weeks of treatment. And I think about her often because not only did she come to us wanting our help in, in being fully committed to our treatment plan, but she had the right attitude. She was determined that she was going to have a great outcome and she did. And I, I think there's something to that.